Why will you never forget about Clinton? They asked. And I responded, Well, I'll never forget coming home, seeing all the town lights from up above, since Clinton is in a bold form. Home to me is my school, where the school staff has supported me in being successful. It is where I, una hija de mexicanos, will graduate. Home is also where I can spend time with my friends, whether it be at a coffee shop, a school event, or a community function. Home to me includes the place I work. It is a place full of wise people who have shown me not only how to better myself as a journalist, but also the great aspects of Clinton. The, the, it's, the, Clinton, the, the, the great part about Clinton is the people itself. Mm -hmm. see, they're, I mean, they're, they're great people. You don't see that you know, in a lot of other places or whatever, but that's, that's probably the greatest thing is just, and, and how people really shine when tragedy strikes, I mean, total strangers will do all they can to help somebody else, you know, if they're really in need and everything. And so that's, that's the greatest thing. That and just the hard working, you know, uh, attitude of Clinton. Also, and, you know, the, the diversity of Clinton is one of its key attributes. Mm -hmm. It's what makes it great. The caring attitude that everybody has. Um, you know, I've always said that people can go anywhere and make money. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, boy, when you can figure out how to make a living and then really enjoy where you live. But did you look at so many things that happen, in, happen right here in Clinton, when there's a need of any sorts, I talked about tragedies, but when there's a need of any sorts, people rally around. We just got through, you know, some, a group of five ladies saw the need to build a new children's park. Mm -hmm. And guess what? You know, it's one of the neatest things there is in Clinton, Oklahoma. Our kids are there every day. Yeah, and now they're rolling up their sleeves trying to find somebody else. I go back 20 years ago, a project that I was involved in was when they built the Children's Park out of Agme Park. Mm -hmm. um, you know, a lot of people today don't realize it, but that park was built in four days. There oh, was, my goodness. There were 717 volunteers showed up to build that entire park in four days. How long has that park been there then? It's been there since like 2000. Because I remember it since I was a big, I thought yeah. it had been there forever. No, nope. and that was just, and, and it all started by another lady in Clinton, Oklahoma, you know, Helen Goldston was her name, and she'd been blessed with making a lot of money in her life, and she wanted to do something for the kids. And so she came up with a deal, if the town would all come together and build it, She'd buy all the materials and everything, and mm -hmm. she donated like $125,000, and everybody else donated their time. That's great. I and, didn't know that. Yeah, and that, that's things that make Clinton a great town. Mm -hmm. While working at the Clinton Daily News, I grew very fond of a certain group of people here in town, the Clinton firemen. To me, they are the definition of humble. They are a great representation of what Clinton is made up of. I can always count on them for help. And then as far as who makes this feel like home would be the firemen that I work with because these guys are really close to me. And um, I've always said this is the best of Clinton, the guys that work here. Mm -hmm. And so um, this makes it feel like home to me. That's what the difference is because our priorities are about serving others and being the best. And I will always say that Western Oklahoma has the best people in the world. Mm -hmm. It's just their heart. It's a heart thing about them wanting to serve their community. And I would put our guys up against anybody that I've been around, for sure. That's awesome. Another place that made its way into the heart of my home is the Pepsi Pop Art Gallery. Inside this building, I see talent, passion, and enthusiasm by an ambitious art teacher and her amazing young art students who inspire me, a photographer. Home is where I know I can find a diverse group of people within my community and where I know I can look up to great leaders, Hispanic leaders, such as Juan Garcia. Oh, the absolute the diversity. The diversity of the you know, the state as a whole um, is, is willing to, to come together and help each other out, but in Clinton you see it 
more so whenever people from all kinds of diverse backgrounds are willing to help each other out and, and they don't, um, you know, hold social economic status against each other. You know, yeah, obviously we have our problems, but the, the ability of the entire community as a whole to come across, you know, and, and help each other out stands out. It's, it's, Clinton is small town America. Soy muy orgulloso de ser de Clinton. Ojalá que sigamos para adelante con ánimo. My home offers a lot, from heartwarming restaurants like Chris Neos or Pedro's to historic sites like the Route 66 Museum. Last but not least, home is my family, my parents, Brenda and Federico, my sisters, Allison and Leslie, who happen to be exact replicas of my face, our dog Libby Lou, and other relatives who live in one of two places, Clinton or Torreon, Coahuila, Mexico. The home my family provides includes love, joy, and a great abundance of delicious Mexican food. My household celebrates various Hispanic festivities, such as Dia de los Muertos or Mexico's Independence Day. Home is the place where I learned to speak my first language, el lenguaje nativo de mis padres, the one that has opened more opportunities for me.